you squad number three we are back packed five man we gotta say we are just loving the pack five vibes right now i mean you guys are dope all the love that you're kind of throwing our way man it is off the chart who would have known couple of fellas out from the north side of brisbane just bringing it and it just going the way it's going it's going places and we're just loving that so definitely keep subscribing keep kind of checking out the content hey we are up to week three and i gotta tell you something man we have got our week plan for you this is an episode you are not gonna want to forget because this week we got a new prank but you know we're gonna be away for a couple of weeks so we thought new prank this time what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a double prank what let the beat what? Oh, that's right we're bringing two pranks and the best thing about this double prank is we are pranking Ange and Rach. Yes, you heard us, Ange and Rach, last week. We said, hey, let us know who you want us to prank. And guess what? You told us, it's loud and clear, you want us to hit Ange and you want us to hit Rach. So we thought they live together. Why not hit them both in the same week? And check this out, squad. We've even set it up, right? We set it up so Ange thinks we're pranking Rach. It's gonna be so good. And Rach, Thinks we're pranking Ange. Hey Ange, uh, so I got you girl. So enthusiastic are they? They've jumped in to help us prank the other. Little do they know, all they're doing is providing us with key intel on how we're gonna prank them. So check it out squad, it is week three, it is vlog three, it's Joseph, it's pranks, it's double pranks, and it is going off. Check it out squad, I'm with my boy, the nation, what up? And check this out, thanks to all your love. Man, we are going places, and now we have the Pack 5 Mobile, what up? Check it out, we are in the Pack 5 Mobile. We are cruising, can't wait to get this prank together. We're thinking giant inflatables. We got breakfast cereal. Man, it is all Get came. happening. Get, Get came. came. We are feeding you for the next like month. So you're welcome. Yo squad, check it out, Joseph! Week three, if you were here last week, you might remember we kind of left the story in the whole incident with kind of Joseph and Potiphar's wife, where Joseph like tried to run away from Potiphar's wife, but then she grabbed his coat, and then Joseph got in trouble for doing something that he didn't do. He got tossed in jail, and she kind of got off scot-free, and we're jumping into the story at the point at which Joseph's in jail, but he's now up at the top of the jail. He's kind of ruling in sort of the jail space. And as we kind of looked this week, there's two more people that come into jail. A cupbearer and a baker from Pharaoh, the king of Egypt's kind of palace. A cupbearer being the person who kind of serves wine to the king, makes sure it's not poison, right? Well, they both get thrown in jail. And then one day they're like looking real sad. And Joseph kind of sees them. And he's like, what up, boys? Hey, what's so sad? Come on, let's just see if we can't turn that frown upside down. Talk to brother Joseph, what's going on? And they're like, yo, we had some like crazy dreams, but there's like nobody here who can kind of interpret those dreams. And Joseph's like, hey, good news. I know God, God knows dreams. So lay it on me, brothers. What up? Tell us your dreams. And so then the cupbearer's like, all right, I've gone first. Had this dream and it's all about grapes and vines and wine and serving wine to Pharaoh. And he's like, I don't know what's going on with all of that. And Joseph's like, hey. So here's the thing, few days time, you're getting out of here and you'll be back in the position that you were in before. Kind of serve a wine to the king, yo. That's dope as. But hey, brother, when you get there, just don't forget about me. You know, like I just did you a solid. So remember me, do a solid, help a brother out. And then the baker, he's like hearing all this. And he's like, yo, what? Oh, this sounds lit. Joseph, my man, I had a dream too, right? And I'm thinking, this is going to be dope. So I had a dream, saw that bread. It was kind of bread on my head. And then birds eating bread off my head. So I'm getting out of here too, right? 
And Joyce is like, yo, like y'all did have a dream and it is about you getting out of here in a couple of days, but brother, ain't such good news for you because like three days time when you get out of here, Joseph says to this guy, yo, Pharaoh gonna kill you. And sure enough, as the story kind of plays out, that's exactly what happens. The cupbearer ends up with Pharaoh and the baker, <laughs> Pharaoh kills him. But here's the thing. Right? The point at which we're in the story, so we're going to be jumping into it, youth, tonight. The thing is, Joseph is left in prison and the cupbearer just completely forgets all about him. And Joseph's dead in prison, like, cupbearer, come back! But for like two years, Joseph's just waiting for that moment where the cupbearer is going to come good. And what played out, as we kind of pick up the story tonight, Pharaoh has a dream. And it's this dream that Pharaoh has is going to be the glimmer of hope for Joseph. That's what we're looking at tonight. But before we do, before we get into all of that, hey, check it out how this double prank went down. What? Yeah, ah! yeah, let's go. I'm just sitting around the corner from Andrew and Rachel's place. And in a moment, we're going to drive up there and Rachel's going to let us in, thinking that we're pranking Ange. So she's going to let us into the house and we're going to start the prank for Ange. And then she's going out. And when she goes out, we're going to go in. We're going to fill her shelves with breakfast cereal. It is going to be so lit. Yo, check it out, squad. The prank is in action. We've got a couple of extra helpers. Look, Em is in the house. What up? What up, squad? Got the boys here. We've got a special guest joining us. Yay. What up, <laughs> gang, gang? Here we go. We are pranking Rach. We are pranking Ange. It is going to go off. Five minutes past eight and we are just chilling. I think everyone's pretty hungry and pretty bored. He loves being part of pack five. He would never admit it on camera, but secretly he wants to be <laughs> pack you? six. That is exactly what he's there for. <laughs> what up? Hey. It's Raquel. Hi. What up? Oh, hey, G. Welcome to the pack squad. Oh. We in. Love you. You've got a very nice time. One eternity later. <laughs> what is it? Alright, let's have a look. It smells like... It smells like popcorn, but I can't see any popcorn. But I don't know where the popcorn is. <laughs> Follow your nose. <laughs> it's nice. You gotta think like the popcorn. If I wasn't popcorn, where would I be? <laughs> oh, what? Oh. oh my gosh. What on earth? <laughs> <laughs> wow, oh guys, God. next <laughs> level. <laughs> breakfast is sorted. <laughs> breakfast. <laughs> you get to melt the Oh my god, that's actually full. <laughs> that's ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <my God. laughs> that's it. You pranked me. 
He actually pranked me. I was like, <laughs> I told them when I got home, I was like, so you better not have been pranking me while I was out. <laughs> nah. Sure enough, they got me. <laughs> Sensation. You got breakfast. <laughs> you got breakfast. <laughs> Moments later. Check it out, Pack 5 Mobile, how about it? It is so dope. And I gotta say, I got some really exciting news. Like, it's hard to fully believe just where this whole Pack 5 thing is going. And it's all thanks to you, our followers, our subscribers. But guess what? We have, I'm so excited to introduce to you our first Pack 5 sponsor, Nickaboo Creations. We are in negotiations with them right now about releasing our very own Pack 5 merch line. So stay tuned to check that out. Coming weeks, we're gonna have our own Pac-5 gear. Shout out to Nickaboo Creations. You can kind of check them out. Uh, have a look at their Facebook page in our description below. Go and follow them, give them a good like, and get on with it. Yo squad, hope you love the vid. Double pranks, how good are they? Definitely subscribe, definitely like the vid, share the vid. Hey, we're gonna be away for a couple of weeks. Uh, so stay tuned, but we're gonna be definitely back in a couple of weeks time after Double Up. Invite your mates to Double Up, definitely do that. We're gonna be back, we're gonna have more pranks, ready to go. It's gonna be lit, stay fresh people. Mm -hmm.